homework well. I am completely done with research, but the quick just gonna write paper with the research I did already. That was funny. That was funny. Um, three. Okay, this three. I think it's weird. But the one that requires the least amount of research is going to be the hardest one to answer. So weird. Um, we have, I mean, we could, we could use information from both textbooks with this, and we could use our sources. Um, I mean, there's so many ways it could answer that question. But the glass ceiling thing. I had a very weird way of answering this until I finally found something just a few minutes ago, which was this one. And I looked in the conclusions and I was like, wait just a second here. Look at this. EPI analysis shows that for Asian and black women, Racial gaps are significantly larger than gender gaps, which gender and with gender and race combined create a double whammy for those my, these minority women. For Hispanic women, the racial gap is smaller than the gender gap. Oh, come on. Really? It's different if you look at different races. Since then. Why is it different? Maybe Hispanic women race doesn't affect them as much as but how does how does that work? That's weird. the specific stuff that relate to it. Race, gender, and the double glass ceiling. Maybe this is where they talk about that. Racial gap is smaller than the gender gap. I don't even know what EPI score means. Dang it. Do I have to read about how what that means? But for every other minority group, the racial gap is bigger than the gender gap, except for Hispanics. So the racial gap for Asians and Blacks is almost twice the Hispanics EPI. Um, black Hispanic women have the lowest racial gap. What does it mean racial gap though? Like. Be, the gap between I have to figure out what that means specifically. Dang it. can literally not hear a single thing going on upstairs. Which 
makes me keep wanting to go upstairs and eat a snack, but but it's very likely that they're actually not going to. Because it's too hard to hear. I just heard somebody walking. That's fine. Hispanic. Uh, how do they define Hispanic? This one. Hispanic. The technical definition of Hispanic means anybody who speaks Spanish. That's literally it. Like even people from Spain could be called Hispanic. But I don't know how, what definition of Hispanic this paper uses. Black men have the highest racial gap. Black men have the highest racial gap. The gap in is this whites have the highest gender gap. Blacks have the lowest gender gap. I don't even exactly know what they mean by gap. What does a gap mean? Crap. What does that mean? I have, to, I have to actually do reading. I can't just copy the quote. Dang it. <laughs> and we examine senior leadership pipeline in companies in all industries by race and gender. We use the executive parity index as a normalized metric to compare representation in executive leadership. Okay, I think that's what we got. So what does it mean to have a gap? They keep referring to a gap. No, 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 no. I don't want to read this whole thing. Come on. It's just one single part of my assignment is this. It's literally just number two. That's all I'm, that's, that's the entire purpose of this is to try to answer number two. God. No, not this one, not number two. I meant number B, not even a full number. It's just part of number three. You've got to be kidding me. <laughs> oh my gosh, what is this? This is the workforce. By race. Fun. That's a fun graph. Why don't you just make it a circle? Why don't you make it a ring? <laughs> you really just had to make it a, a ring instead of a circle? Really? You could have made it a circle, you know. So these are just the workforce in general. So Asians are overrepresented in the workforce, interestingly. Hawaiian point zero zero four Hawaiian. That is it. What's the next size one? American Indian. Dang, that's low. What the heck? What? American Indian should... What is the actual... Okay. Um, two plus races. Mixed race. They literally just put all mixed race into this. Okay. Hispanic is 7%. Black, 8%. Asian, 13%, 69% white. What is this? What? 
oh, this is the executive workforce. Here's the executive workforce. 85% white, 6% Asian, 5% Hispanic, 3% black, 1% mixed race, 0.05 Hawaiian, even less Indian, American Indian. And we got percentage of executives divided by percentage of professionals. <laughs> interesting. That's an interesting way to calculate it. That's actually a pretty simple way to do it. Um, executive parity index. 1.0 means underrepresented or overrepresented. Whites are overrepresented, clearly. Oh, white is overrepresented as 1.23. Black has the worst one at 0.41. Well, they only concluded the four biggest ones. Anyways. And then we got race and gender. Here's race and gender. And white. And compared to the amount of white men. Is an executive compared to the amount of white men is it's comparing percentage of professionals. So percentage of white this same thing here. White. And percentage of women. Women are underrepresented. Hispanic. And hold on. Hold on a second. Where did they get the idea that? The race gap was worse for Hispanic, or not as much for Hispanic. Oh, I'm confused. This is confusing right now. They also, they compared 2015 
from your gap. EPI for white men, the EPI for white women. So therefore, this is the gender gap. The EPI for white women, the EPI for Asian women. This compares how big the gap is. Between white women, and it compares the gap between white women and Asian women. And it turns out for every race, the gap between genders is more than the gap between races, except for Hispanic. We're going to go to the Hispanic one. How on earth did this happen? Wait. 70% racial gap, whereas all the other ones, what? I'm confused. What are you talking about? Aren't you comparing these numbers? These are the two numbers you're looking at right now. What are you talking about? Dude, this, this has got to be a mistake, right? Wait. It's not a mistake. That is way over twice as likely.
Um, I literally can't read. They were comparing these two numbers. This one's bigger than this one. This one's the bigger than this one. This one's smaller than this one. Hispanic. The racial gap is actually not as big. what the gap means. Wow! It, all that for one single question. Oh no. Is the gender-based bank app still a series?
the beat. You sniffed a lot. Wow. It sniffed a lot. I just left. I just left. Okay, number two is so weird. You know, I don't even have any research for that question. She made t she's like, points off, you didn't use a source to support your opinion for number two. Come on. You've got to be kidding me. How? Dude. Dude. 
this is kind of weird. I could have sworn I didn't. Okay. Stupid duh. Um, I didn't hear anything for a while, so I went outside my room and listened upstairs. Couldn't hear anything. Went upstairs. There was nobody in the house. And then I looked out in the front. And then I see my dad in the driveway. I have no idea what he's doing. He's, I think he's doing something related to the boat. But I don't know why nobody else is here. But and my dad's still in the driveway. I'm kind of confused. But anyways, bye.